Yo, what up, y'all? So, um, Ricky Glazer dropped a part uh, on his YouTube channel basically yesterday. That's how I think about it. Anyway, and uh, I thought I'd watch it. I thought I'd check it out. Ricky Glazer, if you don't know, um, he's a skateboarder. Um, I don't know. I think, you know, he's a little alt to some skaters, I guess, because he came up through YouTube mostly um, but he's done a lot of other stuff in YouTube I like this part he does a lot of riding around less flips and he's really good at flips so I mean he could do a lot more flips again not a skateboarding expert um, I like it I like it I like it I would say what I noticed and um, I'm just going to say this because I saw a clip of this kid, Aimu or whatever, he's on S skateboarding. I need to actually react to that if I get a chance. But um, Aimu on S skateboards, and I feel like, I don't know if this is right, but I feel like that's what pros want people to skate like. You know, like they want them to be super, they say steezy, like style, but it seems more like, they want people to progress at a certain pace, which is like, yo, make sure you you can you understand the trick you're doing before you do the trick, I guess. So that it's like you're not just, you know, doing seven tries on something and, and then nailing it, but you're you had a vibe based off of your true knowledge of or something like that, so that the style comes out. Um, yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Um, all I will say, though, that I don't know what this part was for. Because it doesn't really look like a skate park. I mean, it, a skate park. I mean, I guess it does. I'm sure someone's going to be like, oh, what are you talking about? It's crazy. I don't know. Just from what I, I'm usually used to seeing. Obviously, it's five billion times better than anyone who's not a skateboarder could do. And Ricky's an amazing skater. Look at that. Look at that. What do you call that one? E. Bar lip. Key flip. Flip out. But I know some skaters, they don't like when you do that down flip. When you hit the board down, they want you to pop it out. It's floating. You flick it off the side. It rotates upwards still a little bit. Your legs move up. Your knees, you catch the board right under your chin. You slam it down. That's what they want to see. Oh, that was... That was... Um, that was short. Okay, he premiered it. There's a bunch of comments. Let's go back a little bit. I guess this, all this stuff is really hard. I mean, obviously, that has to be hard. This is like a... This is more like a YouTube, I would say, skate park, you know? Because it doesn't yet, to me, illustrate what his style necessarily is. It does a little bit, because I feel like this is his style. This, like, sort of just, like, he has a... He has something in his brain, I because I watched some of his lives too, um, and he it, he has almost like a style of mental approach to stuff more than anything else. Um, but anyway, go watch this part on Ricky's YouTube channel. Check it out. Let him know what you think, and me. Let me know what you think, and if you have any ideas for videos I should react to, uh, other skating videos. You got to be fast though, because I like to react within within a couple days maximum. But if you have anything like that, let me know. Send it over so I can check it out. I see all the comments ASAP Rocky. Not ASAP Rocky. I say ASAP Rocky instead of ASAP. I see all the comments soon. San Francisco. Oh, Fisherman's Wharf. I don't know why I didn't notice that until right now. Fisherman's Wharf. I was there like nine years ago or something. This isn't Fisherman's Walk, though, is it? I don't know what this is. Very cool. Oh, yeah, he's a Bay Area guy. That's funny. Shout out to the Bay Area. I, but I think he's from Australia. But but um, I was born in Oakland, so. All right, y'all.